training accuracy. So accuracy is having your center in a fixed location. See, if you move your center this way or this way, that moves where the ball goes, right? Having your path predictable, which means it's a continuous path. It's not an interrupted change of direction. And then this is the part that most people don't. It's very hard to feel with a golf club. It's not, it's very easy to feel with this, is controlling this orientation, which is this subtle relationship of where your hands are in space. So to make it simplified, put all our weight on one foot, like you might with a, you know, doing a short wedge. People do that because their center doesn't move, right? We'll put our center in one place, place for this exercise. And then control path, control the relationship of where your hands are through the ball. Think of a lot of, you know, I mean, so you could work on this with say, you know, 50 yard shots, control that, feel where your hands are. And now you look how my hands are oriented on this device. I would take them off. It's very much in a position where a grip would be. So now we'll take a club. And we're going to work on that same feeling. Put all our weight here. Orient our hands again, oppositional, just like they were on the e-bell. And we work on this motion. Important part is actually is more here. People don't get off as much here. I mean, you can do this, of course, but that's not so hard. But it's 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 harder not to is to want to really break well, so your center doesn't move forward, and then stay that way. So if you think of like you Mo know, Norman is the perfect example of staying what he called staying with it, which was stay with it, right? Don't change that thing all the way until he like to finish here, but he finished with this back foot down, which, so he couldn't move forward, couldn't move anywhere, found a fixed spot, and then he did that. So like, try it sometime. It it's, looks odd, creates a lot of accuracy. So then we'll just stay with that orientation. And that's going to be, if you square your path to your face, and that's a lot of that is controlling this, you're going to hit a lot of straight shots.